so the other day i went to the beach over here and i went for a hike and guess what i found a lot a lot of lot of lot of different types of rocks and i really 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 love collecting rocks i feel like they are so majestic and I feel like a good rock can tell you a lot of stories like we don't know where it comes from but there is a lot of things that goes behind these rocks so today in this video I'm gonna be showing you different types of rocks that I collected um, at the beach from other day I have collected a lot of different rocks um, from some of them being very 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 big and some of them being uh, tiny little pebbles um, let's start with the first rock and one of my favorite rocks that I found the other day so I would like to welcome you all to the rock ASMR delight prepare to relax and indulge in the smooth and soothing sound of rocks this is my one of my favorite rocks because as you can see it is two different colors and it just came like that and it was so 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 beautiful to me that I said I'm gonna take it home so I brought this little guy home with me And look at the little little inclinations little dents on this rock um, I don't know I feel like it tells a story and um, it's kind of like a yin yang to be honest it's more on the side so it's not as equal as a yin yang but still it's so pretty to look at Uh, this is one of my other favorite rocks um, it is kind of mustard in color it looks really weird to be honest uh, I don't know why this color why it's this color but when I found it it was so smooth to touch and it's still very smooth to touch and it's very interesting colors it has I just think it's really pretty and I was like, okay, you're coming home with me to I literally got a bag full of rocks. Rocks, 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 rocks. Yeah. Let's get to the other one. This is a pretty neat rock, I believe. This is a tiny little rock, but as you can look at it, it is kind of looking like a, um, reminds me of like a dragon's egg. It has like all these scales, little scales kind of going on. You can see it in the sunlight. It is very interesting to look at it. It's kind of, if you look at it, it's kind of maroonish. I don't know if you can see properly. I think. I might need a little bit of extra light to make it show to you guys. As you can see, it's kind of maroon, kind of dark color. Yeah, it's kind of interesting look at it reminds me of like a dragon's egg if you look at it like this very very interesting to me so yeah i like this rock this is also one of my favorite rocks. this one is also a big rock 
and it's a very heavy rock um this is also kind of cute dragon egg kind of looking uh i don't know how to describe it but it has very interesting colors if you look at it it's kind of orange tinge and uh, maroon not a, mar not a really really maroon color but i would say a little bit of reddish in there and then also there is some kind of orange in there as well if you can see that yeah so that is something else that i got and i um call him golu i don't know why because it's like gold it looks like a potato also <laughs> kind of potato looking raw so i call him golu <laughs> yeah yeah i'm that kind of person who names her rocks okay let's move on to the next one this is also one of the um white i don't know i can't remember the name of this rock but it is a uh, crystal kind of something looking like rock and it has a lot of shiny surfaces so it looks very pretty in the sunlight you can see looks very shiny and pretty in the sunlight and i just really like this rock i like the how to, if when you hold this rock it feels like so cool and calming i think rocks have energy in them and i just feel this positive energy when i hold this rock and i feel i i hope i can send you some of the this rock's positive energy to you as well Whenever I feel like I'm getting negative thoughts or something like that, I feel like if I want to pick up a stone, pick up a rock and just hold it in your hand and it feels better. I hope you get all the positive energy through this rock. This is my rock. Now let's explore this uh, cute looking rock and look at the colors on it. It's just gray and mustard or yellowish. It's very interesting to me that all these rocks have these different colors on them um i don't know i growing up never saw all these kind of different rocks uh different colored rocks so when i see them now i'm like amazed like wow this is something very interesting and very beautiful and it has a little bit of shine in it if you can see there are some shiny shiny surface on it and in the sunlight it just shines 
It just shines even more in the sunlight. Listen to the delicate sound of this rock gently colliding uh, with my finger as if it's creating a secret, uh, secret, secret melody um, that only nature can show us, only nature can present us with that kind of melody. the next rock and they are these two rocks uh, one of them is like bigger and then one of them is a little smaller but these two kind of remind me of like a teardrop you know like it's kind of like a teardrop in itself and I thought it was very interesting that they have this kind of shape um, it's a little bit triangular but with more smoother 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 edges you see and um, you can see that it's a little triangular but maybe a teardrop shape um, same is with the, this one and when they collide together they make a very Very interesting song. And guess what? These rocks kind of smell like ocean, to be honest. Um, yeah, they are very cute rocks, I would say. They give out like a little bit cutesy energy. <laughs> I have these three different types of rocks, but I think they are kind of similar because all of them have like a stripes, like a tiger stripe. So I don't know, I feel like nature is just very interesting. So you can see these white stripes, like how it's on a tiger, it's like a tiger rock almost. And it's the same thing with this one that has the stripes, you can see clearly here. They also have the uh, stripes on it and the third one the third one is also interesting it has stripes but only no third one doesn't have stripes so these two rocks kind of have like stripes like as if like um they are like tiger rocks i like to call them tiger rocks because <laughs> They got stripes like a tiger. Right now my hand smells like ocean to be honest. Okay. Now I kind of, now I kinda of wanna show you these little tiny little pebbles I feel. They are so cute, um, if you can look at them, you can tell they are all different colors. This is kind of, um, I would say beige colorish, beige and like, or maybe light gray color, I would say. And then I have this rock with pebble, which is yellow and mustard color. It's all mustard color rock. And then I have this third one which you can see is different colors kind of kind of maroon kind of purple a little bit of yellow in there or orange in there it's it's kind of weird because yeah it's different colors oh 
on this rock. Like all these different colors for some reason. Yeah, you can look at the stripes of this rock. Okay, now um, these two rocks uh, are kind of similar. I mean, actually, they're very, very similar, but they are very pretty rocks. I really find them super duper pretty, and they kind of like shine in the sunlight. You can see that. There's so much shine over here. Mm. pretty right here. It has like a gem or something in there almost. Yeah. I just think they just they rock. <laughs> All these rocks they rock. Um they are really good for I I believe they are really good for um uh, giving out positive energy Last but not the least, I have these two rocks. Um, they are very smooth and pretty big as well. I might want to zoom out a little bit just to show you how big they are. Um, they kind of like are, you know, those uh, gilly danda when we used to play, uh, I guess, or maybe to throw it in a pond and make the um you know like these kind of rocks can skip uh skip on the water i think um yeah but they are really smooth produce really really nice sounds for ASMR especially and 
I'm gonna almost write something with it. But it will wash off if I just remove it from my finger. But they are so smooth to touch, it's so nice to feel these. You can just feel the smooth surface and it's so relaxing. Just to touch these rocks, it's so relaxing. And I hope you are as well relaxed by looking at these beautiful rocks. Thank you for joining me on this rock ASMR journey where these humblest of elements they can transport, at least they transport me um, and I hope they transported you to a world of tranquility and peace and calm. And remember whenever you need a moment of serenity and return to this video, return to the soothing sound of the rocks and reconnect with Earth's harmony. Look, it almost looks like an island. <laughs> okay guys, I gotta go. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Don't forget to like and leave a comment down below if you like this video.